Hey guys in this video we're gonna be checking out the top 5 best satellite messengers and personal locator beacons, that are available on the market for their true quality. I made this list based in my personal opinion and hours of research and have listed them based on popularity, quality, price, durability, user opinions and more. If you want to see more information in the updated price you can check out the description below and also make sure subscribe for more reviews ok so let's get started with the video. Starting at number 5, we have the Garmin INREACH Mini 2. Weighing a scant 3.5 ounces and measuring just 4 inches tall by 2 inches wide, the Garmin InReach Mini 2 is a full-featured satellite messenger that, though minuscule, does everything other satellite messengers do. Garmin uses the Iridium satellite network for pole-to-pole -pole coverage with no gaps. Size comes with a few caveats. Preset messages like, I'm OK, or, stopping for the night, or custom preset messages that you've composed on a computer and synced to your device are easy. Anything beyond that requires syncing the Mini 2 to your phone in the field or using the virtual keyboard. Moving on at number 4, we have the Spot X. The Spot X is a fully contained two-way messenger unit that doesn't use a phone link to make its features more user-friendly. Instead, Spot X has an illuminated QWERTY keyboard that Gear Junkie reported as small, but easy to type on. Depending on which subscription plan you get, the Spot X can offer two-way messaging for half the price of Garmin's comparable subscription plan. See our subscription price comparison chart for more information. Its main perk is that it's a texting device that works everywhere, even without cell reception. The Spot Satellite Messenger uses the Global Star Satellite Network with near-global coverage, with gaps at some parts of the Pacific Ocean and some extreme northern and southern latitudes. At number 3, we have the Ocean Signal Rescue Me PLB-1. Weighing just 4 ounces and measuring 3 inches long by 2 inches wide, Ocean Signal describes its Rescue Me PLB-1 as the world's smallest PLB. Which indeed it is, but not by much. For comparison, a CR's Res Q-Link Plus, a beacon we used to consider for this review but has since been replaced by a newer model which has received poor reviews, weighs just a half ounce more. Size alone seems to be a trivial way of comparing emergency SOS devices. But if you're into carrying the lightest weight, no frills unit, this diminutive, inexpensive PLB may be just what you're looking for. At number 2, we have the ACR Rescue Link Plus. The ACR Res Q Link Plus, now discontinued, was our best PLB last year, but we were concerned enough about some of the updates to remove it from our list. The ACR Res Q Link 400 Personal Locator Beacon has updated its SOS button location to the front of the unit. This makes it too easy for the SOS to get activated from the PLB jostling in a backpack or pocket. One REI user reported the unit accidentally activating itself while he was hiking. A search and rescue team was dispatched, and when they found him, the search team said that this had happened with that unit before. At this time, we cannot recommend the ACR PLB and think that if you want a beacon, you'll be better served by the Ocean Signal Rescue Me described above. And finally at number 1, we have the ACR Bivy Stick Satellite Communicator. The Bivy Stick is a 7 ounces device that turns iOS and Android phones into hotspots, allowing satellite connectivity just like the Garmin's, Spots, and PLBS we reviewed earlier. Bivy Stick requires a phone sync to initiate a rescue. Once you get it, you have two-way communication, so that once you activate the SOS signal you can communicate by text. Thanks for watching and that's all for now, I hope to see you guys in the next video, till next time.